Good afternoon YouTube, Jordan here, and we are back with another vlog, and today we are headed to Call of Duty World League Miami. Uh, and without further ado, we are in the car on the way, so let's get started. sign up before we get to our destination i have never been to my beach like this and it is a very nice place so if you're watching this vlog and you've never been i highly recommend you come here all right we have made it here to the miami beach convention center um we just got a parking spot and it's a really good one if i do say so myself so now we're headed down almost fell to my death uh now we're headed down to actually get into the convention center let's go all right we're out in the sunlight walking up to the convention center parking garage behind me and um, here's the real key factor because I was put on this team pass, so like I'm acting as if I'm part of the team, but um, the team might have been disbanded, so I might not be able to get in. So we'll see. If I come back and I'm still outside, then you know that we didn't get in. I feel bad. I tell you that you should vlog this whole weekend. Maybe. That's what I'm doing, yeah. So, quick break right now. We are walking, we're outside the convention center up the and we're headed <laughs> up the corn. So, we're heading out to a Shake Shack that's down the road and we've got to experience what's walking in Miami's like. So, uh, let's go on this adventure. minutes into our walk. This is Tristan behind me. Met him today. I bought uh, him the pass. Thank you, sir. <laughs> uh, and we are currently still on our walk to Shake Shack. My um, Lord, it's like Guatemala. We have, <laughs> we have really no idea if we're close or not, so I we're just going to keep walking. Huh? You I don't know. know anything. You know nothing, Jon Snow. This man. We finished up at Shake Shack, and uh, okay, we're bootlegging across the way. We gotta go. Bro, next we gotta say something, dude. We almost got hit. What do you mean? Well, my college tuition would've been paid for. But um, yeah, so we just crossed the street uh, dangerously, and now we're headed back to the convention center to continue to watch some pro league gameplay. You know what I'm saying? All right, we made it back to the convention center, which is right here behind me. But we need one more pit stop, and that is to get this man's stuff right here. He needs his charger. And so we're headed to his parking garage that he parked at. Bruh, this man just locked his keys in his trunk. I'm done. I literally unlocked it though. And, oh my God, bro, right. no way. Dude, I don't know what oh, you do. Oh, security downstairs. <laughs> yeah, all right, bet. All right, we'll see how that works out. Well, now with my friend's stupidity, uh, I'm gonna go grab my car from where I parked it in my garage, uh, pay for that, and then I'm gonna repark it over here just in case we actually have to wait for someone or like the police or something, maybe like a locksmith to come actually unlock his car so he can get in and get his keys. So, you know, we're making some real team plays out here. You know, we're out here trying to be a good guy. Hi, kitty kitty. Oh. Hi, buddy. After this, it's gonna be even. I'm not sure who takes it, but it's either reciprocity or heretics against. People. Right now, it's looking pretty good. Yeah, second rotation, first hill can be a hill that you know you get 60 points. All right, so for those of you watching that um, are in the Call of Duty World League. Um, we just saw two players uh, in Abel and free stuff over there, but uh, we were too shy to go take a picture. So, you know, but we're here watching it on the main stage. 
you have to win a search and destroy for heretics. And when we talk search and destroy heretics, it has been that great. Like I don't see them winning two hard points against LG and winning this series. So if heretics is gonna do this, it's gonna have to come from the search and destroy. Yeah, I mean, one good thing we saw, I guess, Susan almost gets one before he drops, so the pinch comes in. Yeah, almost a big play from Formal there. Would have loved to get those streaks, but now Heretics, they do it. They, they're able to get inside Drodd, and this is where they were so... All right, so right now, we're out here at the blackout booth right here. Me and the homie. Uh, blackout on our screen, and I'm pretty sick, to be honest. Feeling so down, I think they should know now. I think they should know what's up. That's that road I've been down. I know how it goes. All right, Miami, it is that time for our all star game coming up next year. I've never said it better myself. We've got to sit in. I want to get you guys ready right. to this all star game. Out there in the crowd. Here, please. What about you guys on the right side? All star game. I need to see who's the loudest side on the main stage. Left side, make some noise. All right, CWL Miami day one has concluded, but our night is just beginning because we are now meeting up with some friends at this pizza place called Pizza Rustica. Rustica, I think it's called. Yes. So we are we are walking there now, and I think we're late because I think our friends are there. So I don't know. We'll see. We got some pizza, damn shit, human goo. We're all out here. Run it up, Nick. Let's go run it up. They gave me a leaf, bro. They gave you a leaf. Alrighty, folks. We have just finished dinner at Pizza Rustica, and it was quite phenomenal. I do say that if you're ever in the Miami Beach area on Lincoln Road, you should definitely make your way there. And... <laughs> so that concludes our night here. Um, for day one and Miami Beach and for CWL uh, Miami. I uh, hope you enjoyed today's vlog and we shall see you next time. Peace. Good night. Oh.